Hello everybody, Johnny Q here. In today's video, I'll be reviewing the Glock 43X. I'll be doing a quick review on what I think, if you should carry it, and if it makes a good everyday carry gun. So let's get into it. So one of my very first Glock purchases was a Glock 43X. I got the 43X specifically because it was a compact carry. It was small and my hand fit around the entire handle. I don't really have small hands to begin with, but the fact that I could wrap my hands around it, I knew that I could learn from this 43X tenfold. And in the last year and a half of concealed carrying the 43X, I've loved it. I only have a few minor complaints. The only complaints that I do have it's that the capacity of the mag is only 10 rounds, hence the Glock 43X, right? And I know that Shield Arms makes a 15 round mag. I just haven't purchased the mag. I don't know why, I just haven't done it yet. I guess I wouldn't have too much of a hard time if I just bought the 15 round magazine from Shield Arms, but I digress. So this is the Gen 5 version. Uh, I got it without the optic, which now I'm regretting. Now I do want to get another 43X with the optic uh, built in because I can shoot this gun with iron sights with ease. If you're not someone who goes to the range all the time or frequently, you're gonna have a hard time with the recoil because this is a small pistol. Small pistols tend to recoil quite a bit and it just depends on your training and how you handle that gun. But for me, as you just saw, I shot every single round into that steel and it was because of the mitigation control that I have of the Glock 43X. The thing that I will say that I do love about the 43X is this. Look at, look at how slim that profile is. I mean, that is slim as can be, and I cannot complain about that. Whenever I conceal carry, I know it's gonna hug my body really, really well. I mean, look at that profile with the holster. It's practically and virtually non-existent as far as it being a thick pistol, and it's not a thick pistol at all. My favorite two parts about this pistol is the slide and the handle. Like I said, being able to fit my hand around this pistol just like this, I feel like it gives me all the control in the world that I would ever want. That's how I can hit steel talon range so efficiently and effectively. And then I bring my second hand over. I'm not even holding this pistol firmly. It just sits in both of my hands like a blanket would sit on your head when you go to bed. A nice fluffy, soft, magical, heavenly pillow. The trigger and trigger reset is brutally amazing. This gun is all stock. I've done nothing different to this gun and the trigger doesn't give me any gripe at all. Every time I go to press it, it comes up to that wall. It's a nice brisk break. Let go of the trigger, back up to the wall, and you're breaking again. It's, it's beautiful, really. <laughs> like I said, every time you break that trigger, it's crisp, it's clean. I'm confident in that trigger, in that pistol itself. And that's why I love the 43X, man. It's, it's a brutally honest firearm. And that's really what I look for in an everyday carry, especially small carry pistols like this. This is a small guy, okay? It's concealable. You can carry it on your waistband, around your ankles, in your backpack, in your car, in between the seats, in a stroller. You can fit this pistol virtually anywhere. It's really fun to shoot. I mean, I, I'm having a blast out here. I could, I could put another 500 rounds to this thing and just be and to be peachy. I mean, this thing is, <laughs> oh man. We've shot 21 rounds already in this video and so far no malfunctions, uh, no feeding issues. It's been great. I should mention that this specific 43X is a Gen 5, and you can tell it's a Gen 5 because it's got serrations up front and in the rear. Being that it's a stock pistol, uh, my sights are still stock. They're the sights that everybody loves. Just kidding, not a lot of people love the iron sights that the Glocks come with, but hey, that's okay. I've been rocking for almost two years. I've had no complaints, uh, and they have not chipped away, surprisingly so, which is awesome. So if you're thinking about getting an everyday carry or just a compact pistol, you could get a Glock 19, but yet it's a little bit more bulky than the 43X. In my opinion, 
I think you should get the 43X and then also get the Shield Arms 15 round magazine. I say that, but I don't even have the magazine, but, but that'll be my next move. I'm gonna grab the Shield Arms 15 round magazine and test it with the 43X. I know with those mags, you'd have to change out the mag release button because the pistol mag itself from Shield Arms is metal and not polymer, which means that this will wear out and the metal magazine will strip it to the point where it won't work. But yeah, sure the Glock 19 looks appealing, but if you wanted to get something compact, something really small and something you could handle and practice on a daily basis, the 43X might be perfect for you. I love that I can take my support hand, wrap it around, have all the control on this 43X. I tell it where to go, I tell it where to shoot, and the fact that I can have my thumb all the way up, uh, almost up to the slide, I mean, that to me, I love that because it's full control for me and how I control the weapon. It's just one of those things where you don't know how much you'll love the 43X until you go out and shoot the 43X, right? So if you want to go to the range, shoot steel, shoot targets, get a 43X. If you want an everyday compact carry, get the 43X. If you just want to go shoot and have fun on the range, get a 43X, you won't regret it. I know for me, every time I conceal carry, if anything were to happen, I can count on the 43X to back me up. It's not going to malfunction on me, and I have full confidence in this pistol. So there you go, it's a quick review on the 43X, all the things I love about it. There are very few little things on this pistol that I don't like, and those things are honestly, are fixable. So it's a great all around everyday carry, small little guy for anybody of any size. So. That being said, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you on the next Johnny Q video. Peace out. Oh, man. That, that's just a blast. <laughs>